ChatGPT made this PowerPoint. If you want to learn how, you must watch this video. So my prompt for ChatGPT was, give me the content for a presentation about the future of artificial intelligence and spread it across five slides. And ChatGPT basically gave me the outline for my presentation, but I wanted to get the content as well. So I had to ask a second time. And in this case, I just asked, give me the content for each point. And just like magic, the content for my presentation was done based on the outline that they suggested. So then you're going to copy this whole answer right here. So just select everything, control C with your keyboard and go to word.new on your browser. This is the official Microsoft website. So you can use Word or other apps for free. You just need to sign in with your Outlook or Hotmail account. So now I just pasted the text into a new document. And something very important is that the first line needs to be the title of your presentation. So in this case, it's going to be this one. You don't need to format it. Just make sure that it's on the first line. Then you're going to go to file, export and export to PowerPoint presentation. And now Word is reading the content of our document and suggesting some templates that could work with what we have there. And it's taking the title to define the theme of the template. So if you don't like any of these options, you can click on see more templates there. And here you have other options. So I'll just pick this one for now and I'm going to click on export. It's basically preparing my slides and then you can just click on open presentation and it will open the online version of PowerPoint, which is free for anyone who has a Microsoft email account. And just like magic, our content is already on the slides. Some layouts already have icons. It even identified which were the dividers, which is incredible. And now I want to make it look better. So I'll open it on my actual PowerPoint program, not the online version. And as you can see, the fonts sometimes are very difficult to read. Like for example, here, the text is all crammed. So I'm going to replace that very quickly. I'll open the designer tab as well, because here is where we're going to get our suggestions for layouts. And first let's replace the fonts. So let's go to view, then click on slide master. Here you can click on the first slide, then go to fonts, customize fonts. And here I'm going to pick a different font for the headings. And I'm going to pick a different font for my body texts, something that it's easier to read. So something like century Gothic, for example, and then just click on save and then click on close master. And now our fonts have been replaced all across the slides. Now for the cover page, let's go to insert and let's add a stock image. So here I'll look for something that's more related to my topic. So something like a robot, I'm going to select this one and click on insert. And now if you bring the designer tab again, it will give you options with that image that you just inserted. So we can pick something like this one. And if we want to make the text pop a little bit more, we can just add a little bit of transparency. And that's how you can go through each layout and just make it look better than the default options. As you can see, all of my texts are in uppercase. So to replace that, I'm just going to select the smart art, which is this set of icons and text. And then just click on this button here and change it to sentence case. And then you can just play around with making them larger or bolder to make them more legible. 
if you go to home and click on designer you get other options for layout so because this one is the evolution of AI maybe a timeline is more suitable and that's how quickly you can replace the layouts obviously because this is all predefined by PowerPoint it's got its limitations my suggestion is always to design your own layouts I've got a lot of tutorials on my channel so you can create jaw dropping designs but this is a very quick and easy way to create a presentation remember that whatever you put on the slide it's gonna affect the suggestions that you get from the designer tab so whatever image that you add or icons that you add are gonna be implemented in the suggestions of the layouts from the designer tab so for example now that I added this image I got all of these new suggestions for layout some of them actually have animations on the text which is pretty cool so this is what I got with ChatGPT and some magic from Word and PowerPoint online as you can see it's a very basic presentation but honestly it could be a great start for an amazing presentation remember that I have free slides available on lurutiappt.com don't forget to subscribe and to follow me on Instagram and TikTok at lurutiappt as always thank you so much for watching thank you so much for your support and I will see you on my next video